For, first of all, I don't think I don't think it can be a good idea to like set all those people uh, selling selling stuff on the Telegraph because the Telegraph is very narrow. I wouldn't uh, encourage that because uh, you have other vendors uh, who are already you know, on the Telegraph selling their things and you just increase more competition and um, street like you know, not all of the sidewalks are for you know, uh, vending. I think I'd, I'd be pretty much against that. Number one, because usually when people sell shirts on Telegraph, um, it's usually for a very specific cause, uh, and so it's there's there's not nearly as much as if you were to go inside a store. Um, I don't mind that, and also I guess I've actually grown up in a neighborhood where every Friday and Saturday my street, the stores will actually set up booths and have some like a fair. Uh, and uh, for storefront to do that, you are competing with them, and you are push, you are, you know, crowding out this already um, competitive, you no, know, uh, industry. So I wouldn't, I wouldn't suggest that. Having somebody sell shirts as a business on Telegraph would, you know, they'd have a little bit of advantage in the competition, and it would kind of make the people who are trying to raise money for important causes fade into the background a little bit because there's so many other people who are here. So, so you do not support I would them? Not support them it, no, because I think it would, it would subtract from the people who are trying to sell things on Telegraph for important causes. In terms of, I guess it'll be disadvantage to current vendors in the sense that can they kick them out because they're sharing the same space, then that is a little unfortunate, so I don't know about that. I mean, compete is a different sense in this, because I don't think the stores and then the vendors sell some of the same products, and it's not even about competition, it's more, I'm more concerned if they're getting displaced, so I don't think competition would be that big of an issue if they're next to each other, I mean, whoever sells or whoever has a better product has a better product. But if one gets displaced, then it's not really competition. It's just they don't have a place anymore. So. Uh, I, uh, uh, I don't mind. I don't mind at all. But I think other people might, might, might uh, like very sad or very mad about they taking a lot of space or taking a lot of uh, straight to do their thing. The traffic, I have a feeling that if I came to te Telegraph to shop for shirts or something like that, that I would come to ch I would not pay as much attention to people who are here in stands anyway. I, th I don't think the increase in traffic would be significant enough to justify the loss. I also came from a city where it's super crowded, <laughs> so I'm kind of used to it, so I don't really mind. Oh, where are you from? I'm from New York. Okay. <laughs> so right. yeah, I'm kind of used to shoving through people. It's